So hi everyone, this is Arielle, one half of Soju for Two, and welcome back to Drama Central. Um, I'm going to talk about a few dramas that I'm currently watching, um, Taiwanese, Japanese, and Korean, and just tell you what I'm loving at the moment, what I'm looking forward to. So let's get back to a few recaps. So the first drama I want to talk about is a Taiwanese drama. I'm also going to make a uh, watching now of this drama, so check that out. It's called Boy Sitter. And I'm like, what is this title? I tried to explain it to my sister and she's like, um, yeah, it sounds strange. It sounds strange. I'm actually really enjoying it. Um, the male lead is definitely my type, so I'm really, like, I like his style. Um, and it's kind of like, it feels a bit to me like the intro to Flower Boy Ramen Shop, the Korean drama, um, but then it's a little bit different. I don't know, it's just good. I like it. The second one is Tokyo Kiss 2. So this is Japanese drama, and I'm watching this for Drama Fever Drama Club. If you guys haven't seen it yet, check those out. I'll put the link below. Um, and I hate this drama, but I'm still watching it because there's, like, this cute side character that I'm kind of um, enjoying. For me, the, the like, um, started with the Kiss dramas, you know, the Taiwanese, the, the Japanese, the original Japanese, and the Korean. I just cannot get behind any of them, so not my favorite. The next one is a Korean drama drama, Valid Love. So I made a watching now of this drama a little while ago, and I really enjoy this drama. It's a melodrama, and it's a family drama, but this one, I think, has a lot of heart to it. It's really well written, and the characters are sort of a little bit more complex than your average characters. And also, I can't always predict what's going to happen. I don't know what's going to happen with this drama, and something about that I really enjoy, and I think it's pretty different from other ones. The next one is Healer, which is Korean, and I love Healer. It's one of those, like, really feel-good dramas, so if you're having a bad day, like, watch an episode of Healer, and they're like, touch hands, and you're like, oh, it's so cute. So, um, it's a very innocent drama, and I think it's very, um, just for fun, action, um, high-energy drama, which I'm really enjoying. And the last one is a new uh, Japanese drama, and it's called... Gakao no Kaiden. Um, I'll put the link down below. Um, as you know, my Japanese isn't good, but I'm going to make a watching now of that too. And what I'm enjoying about that drama is that it's sort of like you have a strong female lead. It takes place in high school, and it's kind of like cute and fast and interesting, and it's not exactly what you expect from a high school drama. So I'm enjoying that one. So things that I know are coming up soon, so um, Jekyll, Hyde, and Me it comes out soon, if not this week, um, so I can't wait to start watching that. I miss him, Ben. I'm happy to have him back. Um, also, Spy came out this week with Jaejong, and I watched the first episode. I wasn't impressed, but I'm going to give it another episode because my friend uh, told me she really liked it, so I'm like, okay, I'll give it another chance. Um, and if you guys have any recommendations for dramas I should be watching, please let me know down below. Um, and any of the dramas that you've seen recently that were great, I'd love some recommendations. But I am watching a lot of dramas. Um, so those are just sort of a couple of dramas I'm watching now to give you guys like some hints if you don't know what to watch. But I think out of all of those dramas right now, my favorites, um, my favorite is definitely Healer, um, the Korean drama. And I'm enjoying Boy Sitter. I think that's a really cute Taiwanese drama. So if you need some recommendations, I hope those help. And as always, please subscribe and like and tell me about what dramas you're watching. Bye, everyone.